Hey, what's up guys? It's Andre with Apollo Automation again. Uh, in our previous video, uh, we had discussed kind of the basics of tuning the radar gates and zones uh, with the MSR-1. Today, we're actually gonna get a little bit deeper in there uh, with kind of separating extraneous movements. Uh, for example, if you have something that is moving at a baseline state, like a rotating fan or something in a room, and you don't want that to trip the presence sensing, uh, we're gonna show you kind of how to tune out the signal versus the noise, so to speak. Uh, when you are adjusting your MSR-1. So with that, let's go ahead and jump into it. All right, guys, so for this particular example, what we're gonna be using is uh, an oscillating fan, and that's going to be our extraneous movement that we're gonna try and cancel out uh, because it's falsely detecting that there's presence in zone one. If you'll remember zone one in our previous example, uh, in our uh, radar gates and zones videos, uh, the light would light up red when it was detected uh, that there was presence in zone one. Um, and so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into radar engineering mode in the dashboard, and we're going to see which gates are detecting that movement. And we're going to raise the movement threshold on those gates to, we usually recommend about 10% above what the detected movement is. And that should cancel out the extraneous movement detection and it'll actually change to detect me. Uh, and I'm sitting in zone two. So you'll see the light change from red to blue based on where the presence is detected. Um, so let's go ahead and see what that looks like. All right, guys. So now we are in the MSR1 dashboard. Um, you can do that just uh, the same way I've shown you before uh, in the previous radar video. Um, and if you'll note, it's detecting zone one is occupied and that's because of that oscillating fan. So we want to actually take care of that and make sure it's detecting people and not just things. Um, so what you're going to want to do is toggle on radar engineering mode. And that's going to give you the ability to see which gates have movement and which gates don't. So you'll see that gate one has a lot of move energy and gate two has a lot of still energy and gate zero has a lot of move energy. So we're gonna move the move thresholds for gate zero and one, which are picking up the fan, all the way to 100%. So it cancels those out and you'll now see that it's going to detect zone two is occupied because that still energy is actually me sitting in, in zone two. Um, so that's kind of, in a nutshell, how you can filter out extraneous movement in the context of something like an oscillating fan, or it, you know, it can be something a little bit less extreme than that, so you wouldn't have to necessarily move that threshold all the way to 100%. Okay guys, so this is a bit of repetition, but I'm just gonna show you visually uh, with kind of a side-by-side -side of the dashboard. Um, you know, you can see that it's detecting the fan and the LED is red right now. Next, you'll see we're going to pull up radar engineering mode. And you'll see that it's detecting in gate one and gate zero that there is a lot of move energy and 100% still energy in gate two, which is where I was sitting. And now we're going to tweak the move thresholds for gates zero and one. So we're gonna crank those up to 100% here and you'll see kind of flickers a little bit for a second between zone one and zone two as you're changing gate zero and gate one, but then it settles on that zone two is occupied, which is correct because that's where I was sitting in this video. All right, guys, so that was our video, kind of a deeper dive into some of the uh, more granular tweaks in the engineering mode for the MSR-1. Uh, so hopefully that was helpful uh, between this video and the previous one about radar gates and zoning. Hopefully you have a pretty good idea of how to adjust it uh, to your liking. Um, so if you want to see more videos like this, more explainers, uh, more behind the scenes uh, here at Apollo Automation, please get subscribed. Check us out on our socials and uh, feel free to check out the chop in the video description below. Thanks so much.